today I'm going to be showing you how to do faux bangs, fake bangs. If you ain't got no bangs, if you don't want to go all the way and do the cut like me. First thing you're going to do is brush your hair completely smooth. Now gather it all up into a kind of mid to high ponytail. I'm going to be using this amazing product called a pony yank. This is a ponytail holder that does not pull or yank or hurt your head. If you have long hair, you know the struggle of trying to have a pump, get a ponytail that's like, you know, comfortable, especially if it's a high ponytail. So these are really, really amazing. Um, they don't ever, ever give me a headache with a ponytail. I can wear them all day. How they work is you put it in there and then you squish it with the length of your hair all the way through the ponytail. Then fold one end under and then the other end under, kind of like back around itself. And that makes your ponytail. Then just begin twisting your hair into a bun shape. You want to twist around until you have like a little bit of hair left hanging down in the front. So I have a little bit extra, but we're going to fix that in just a minute. Sitting on the length of your hair depends on how big your bun will be in the back. So now my hair is still a little bit too long, so I'm going to twist it around two of my fingers and pin it like another little bun against the bun I already have. So just pin that bun as well leaving a little bit of hair down the front. Just kind of make it down like your, to your nose. The rest of the hair, we want to protect it from the heat. So I'm going to take this really good um, spray from Avita. Spread your hair with your fingers across the length of your head. And then add your headband. Then just kind of tug and pull until the bangs are a bit shorter, about the length of your nose to your mouth. I'm going to take this really nice curling iron, and I'm going to begin to curl the bangs. I'm going to curl on one side, kind of diagonal shape, toward my face. Hold it for like 10 to 15 seconds. Then I'm going to take the middle part, and the middle part needs to be a lot thicker than the ones on the side, so, or wider, and then just curl that one straight under. Now we're going to tease it. You want to tease it underneath because sometimes your hair is thinner at the ends and you don't want your like forehead or hairline peeking through. So to make them look like really thick, like normal bangs, we want to just Tease just a little bit. Pull up more if you need to. Tease and be, I'm just tweaking it and making it look the shape that I want it to look. Now I'm going to take this hairspray and just spray them really well, like right where the so called root of the bangs would be. I kind of just tease them and then just kind of brush it a little, like brush over the top of where I teased it to where it makes it look like smooth. Spray it again and you're done. I hope you guys enjoyed this faux bangs tutorial.